Number three says a tiger shark caught off the coast measured nine feet. Measure this shark, it's nine feet. That's a big shark. What is the length of the shark in inches? So even though they measured it, they kind of made a mistake there and they should have measured it in inches. So they want us to fix that for them. That's fine, not a big deal. My equivalent measure, fact about feet and inches. I need to start off with that. One foot equals how many inches? How many inches are equal to one foot? Who can tell me either by looking at our work that we did before or by looking at that conversion chart? What should it be? Alexa? Twelve inches. One foot One. is equal to twelve. Okay. So I know that. That's a fact. One foot is equal to twelve inches. I'm going to put the feet on top, inches on the bottom. One foot is the same thing, 12 inches. But 12 inches. But when they measured the shark, the shark was not just one foot. Since I put feet on the top, here. The shark, when they measured it, was actually nine. I need to figure, or sorry, not nine inches, nine feet. I'm getting ahead of myself there. Well, I've got to change my numbers from one to nine and from 12 to that's what I got to figure out. One times what would give me nine? What do I have to multiply times one to make it nine? Okay. What I multiply, Nikai? One times what? Nine. One times nine would equal. Well, if I did that to my feet, I've got to do that to the inches too. I have to be fair. Twelve times nine. So that's my number sentence. Twelve. Let's do the math. Nine times two. What's nine times two? Alexa, nine times two is what? Nine times two, nine, nine times two is 16? Close, not 16, 18, there you go. Now I can't just write 18 down here. I have to put an eight, carry over a one. Now I can multiply the nine with the tens place. Nine times one. Who can tell me what is nine times one? Chase? Nine. But I also carried over an extra one. So what's nine plus that extra one, Chase? Ten. 
Look at that, 108. And it used to be feet, but now we change it into what? 108, not feet anymore. What is it now? What did we change it to? Into 108. The fence in Mrs. Vargas's backyard, seven feet high. What is the height of the fence in inches? So the fence was seven feet high. They've already measured it, but the problem is that they should have measured it in inches. So we've got to change it. Know that one foot is equal to 12 inches. My feet on top, inches on the bottom, but 12 inches. I'm going to keep the same thing over here on this side, on the top, on the bottom. But I need to change these numbers. When they measured Mrs. Vargas's fence, it was 7 feet high. I don't know how many inches that is but I can figure it out. You could use multiplication. Who could tell me what number would I multiply? One times what? Alexa. One times seven. One times seven, which means I have to multiply 12 times seven. Hey, we're doing our seven song this week. Who can tell me what that answer would be? Twelve times seven, give me one. Chase, twelve times seven would be? Eighty-four and eighty-four what, Chase? Because we fixed this, we changed this. It used to be feet, but now it's... 84 inches. If I take a look at my question, the correct answer is answer C.